Hey Jets, Scheme Rhythm here. And Stuart plays. With Stuart watches Ryan play Ninja Goddamn. Ding! I don't know if we should count it for... Oh god, that's right, I'm fighting again. No, no, we count all goddamns. Because goddammit, they're all really goddamn important. Ding, 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 ding. Son of a biscuit. <sighs> you mean, son of a goddamn biscuit? Ding! <laughs> <laughs> uh. You know, maybe I should just swallow my pride and use that elixir whenever I get too low on health. You sure you're not going to need it later? The thing is, I know I'm going to need it later. The question <laughs> is, does it matter that much? <laughs> I know what game I'm playing, Stuart. I know I'm going to need it later. Uh, no, it's going to get real fun is when we get to the Fiend challenges. But let's not talk about the Fiend let's challenges. Not get ahead of ourselves. We're still in the first <laughs> encounter, Ryan. I know. Okay, he's dead. And he's dead. Yeah. Ignoring you, Ayane. <sighs> we have to do Ninja Goddamn 2 if we ever get through this one. <laughs> like next semester. Yeah, next semester. How many levels are there in this game again? Um, I don't remember. I think there are like 20 something. Something like that. Yeah, next semester's not too far off. <laughs> well, I'll be getting... Obviously, once you get through the first few levels, it's not nearly as bad. Yeah. I say obviously, but that's kind of... That's kind of how modern gaming works now, isn't it? With hard games, isn't it? I guess. Yeah, this time or do I? Um, let's do together. NINJA FORTRESS! <laughs> this is working, this is working. That's not working. <laughs> okay, is he dead yet? Cross shot. Yeah. Fatality. Uh, well, at least it only took me one try to get back to where we started the video. No, stop! Uh, yes. <laughs> you. I don't think you can pause in midair. Makes the game more challenging, Stuart. <laughs> and they changed it subsequently in future releases, by the way. Changed it to what? So that you can actually pause and use stuff like that in midair. Really? You think he'd like purposely avoid doing that? Well, that was those are the ones that Hayashi was in charge of, not Itagaki. <laughs> Speaking of which, I haven't played either of the Sigma games because I don't have a PS3. Essentially the same thing though, right? <laughs> yes. And in this game, that's right, there's no point in saving the lives of the Thousand Gods, so you might as well just use them. In the second game, they heal you all the way when you use them. In this game, nope! <laughs> It's funny, if you think about it, there are a lot of things in the second game that should, by all means, make it easier, but it's not. That could be partly because the second game is so buggy. Well, actually, a lot of the bugs in the game really don't interfere with, uh, with, um, with the gameplay, honestly. You mean, like, respawning enemies if you go too far behind where their spawn point is? Well, that you have to, like, be trying to trigger that, though. Hmm, yes or no. There are a couple areas where they just kind of show up out of nowhere. <sighs> burp. Oh no, I don't dare burp. Why not? Spicy Indian. Oh. You'll, it'll be like a poison gas. <laughs> I see. 
I swear to God, I've never had anything that spicy. You remember that story India made, like, a gas bomb out of one of their spices? <laughs> <laughs> like, it was, like, the spiciest thing in the world, and they made a bomb. They make, like, a gas bomb out of it for police to use. Yeah, dude, I mean, that's like pepper spray. Yeah. That works. Double beheading from a vertical slice? Sure. So do you know anyone who's gotten pepper sprayed? Or, like, tasered? No. Which is weird. Actually, I'm sure I do. I just haven't heard the story from him because my uncle is a cop. So. One of my friend's friends accidentally pepper sprayed themselves in the face. That does not sound... Oh, shit! Well, it's... You know how, like, some girls carry pepper spray around their purses? Uh-huh. Yeah, they just bought a canister of it, and they'd never used it before, so... Testing it out, like, on the wall or something, they didn't realize that the canister was facing them. <laughs> they are holding it the completely wrong way. Ah. Yeah. It's okay, I made up for it. What? Why did he drop blue essence? Why? Are you sure? NINJA FORTRESS! <laughs> I'm pretty sure someone heard us say that. <laughs> uh, I hope that laughter comes out in the video. I don't know what to think. I win. Ha! Of course, these guys don't drop blue, blue essence whenever I need it, but the guys earlier, whenever I was at full health. Like, oh, we better drop blue essence, you might need it. Thanks, guys! Uh, yes. <laughs> no hesitation. Uh, yes. Of course, no hesitation. Which is a shame, because you know how this boss is. The boss is for this level. And how. But, the good thing is, once I reach the save point, everything else is, like, within walking distance of that save point, so. No. 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 Fuck. No. No. No! Say it. God Say damn it. it. Ding! <laughs> uh. This is gonna be unbelievable. People are gonna be like, PRACTICE THE GAME FIRST, YOU FUCKING NOOB! Yeah, well, we kinda did, a couple months ago. <laughs> well, yeah. And I haven't played this game at all since then. Fail. That was a fail. I knew it was gonna happen eventually. I'm kind of impressed it took me this long for it to happen, though. <laughs> Ah, gosh. Yay, another look. Wait, that means I have two of those. Damn it! <laughs> two fails in a row. <sighs> yeah, no. Oh god, they avoided it! They're learning! Stop learning my attacks! Straight to the crotch. Yep. <sighs> I cannot wait for when I actually get, like, enough health to survive these guys and own them. No, not this again. <laughs> Try to, like, change your aim. It's kind of hard to aim in the center of a widescreen TV. <laughs> okay, I know these are going straight at the bird. They're just off a little bit. Are we going to leave this in? <laughs> Definitely. <coughs> we shall not leave any fail on... What's the word I'm looking for? Edited? <laughs> any fail... All fails go unedited. Of course, it's part of the fun of watching someone play Ninja Goddamn on Master Ding. Ninja. On Master Ninja Goddamn. <sighs> Fucking... Thank you. Sure. <laughs> he apparently hates profanity. But only strong profanity, like F. Like the F word. Maybe we should call him a cunt next time. <laughs> Okay, I'm impressed that this guy is still alive. There we go. Okay. 
Stop trying to fight him normally. Oh no! Damn it. Elixir? Sure. I have two of them. Shameless! And of course, as soon as I use it, I don't get hit at, after that. Yeah, well, you know. You never know. It's only, maybe it's only because I took it that I didn't get hit after that, though. You know, the whole psychology thing. Well, you gotta do whatever it takes to Ninja get for Ninja Fortress! Fortress. <laughs> what were you saying? I was gonna say, you gotta do whatever it takes to get to be ready for the Ninja Fortress. But you ruined my dramatic opening. <sighs> my bad. Okay, seriously? Seriously, guys? What was that? Thank you! Finally! <laughs> they don't die! Why? Uh. Oh, but that's not what you gotta worry about. This is what you gotta worry about. No, it's the room after this that I have to worry about. Because the room after this is that I have to worry about this five times like seven, and I still got one shot there. <laughs> oh, God. Don't <laughs> relative, Ryan. This is the furthest we've gotten, so. This is like the boss battle. Ah, Coke! Give me some Coke! Maybe I'll, my voice will change like NCS's. <laughs> In the bathroom. In the bathroom! I can't do it. Only he can. Yeah, only he can. Bow in deference. Yes. Hello, little mouse. If I could, I would kill you just to get your essence and use them against these guys, so I don't have to work nearly as hard. <sighs> eventually. Eventually. Actually, you know, it might be a good idea to montage this one instead of making it, like, one continuous thing, just because it would be stupid to have one video dedicated to going through one area. I mean, like, or five two videos dedicated to going through one area? That's exactly what I meant, actually. Well, I would imagine since it's going to be so uh, repetitious, our commentary might get kind of stale after a while, so... Yeah... Good idea to montage it. Gotcha this time, you stupid cunt. I, I don't like the word cunt, actually. I feel really dirty when I say it. <laughs> no, it's pretty much the exact opposite for me. Because, like, only British people say cunt. So it's never really threatening enough. Ice! Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I can say, like, fuck. Very easily. Very, like, without any second thought to it, unless I'm, like, around my grandmother or something. Ninja, Ninja Fortress. Fortress! Did you say just. Did you just say Ninja Fortress? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna have to fight these guys while laughing like that. Uh, there's no walls to jump off of, damn it! Can't jump off the wall next to the doorway? Uh, I can. I can also jump off their heads and it works functionally the same. There! He just got stabbed up the ass. Jeez. It's like... It's like that Dark Souls video that we never got to <laughs> upload. Up your butt! Up your butt! Up your butt! All this talking about going up your up the butt is making me quite weary. There seems to be an unhealthy obsession with asses in video games. Especially Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, seriously! <laughs> it really made me wish I had started doing an ass... Just an ass shot uh, count or something on that. I'm gonna do a montage later on. I'm probably going to. Did I just do that room, like, perfectly? Okay, we know the secret now. Every time we enter a hard room, we have to start talking about asses. <laughs> Ugh. Yay, increased health meter. But fuck you, we're not gonna regenerate. Yeah. You know what? Fuck it. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes, really. <laughs> Alright. 
Alright, here he goes. I really hope we, like, increase the sound of the buttons. Just so people can hear what I'm doing. <laughs> like, Christ. I don't know how I'm managing to talk and do this at the same time, but I am. This is what playing Ninja Goddamn is like, people. Lots of swearing, and lots of button mashing. But except there's actually like a rhyme or reason to every single one of my button mashes. It's like typing an essay. It is. <laughs> oh god! Yes, this is happening again. Item conservation? What's that again? Why would I use that? Look at this! You know what? It's like, if I get, as long as I get through this, oh wait, that's right, I have to get through the room AFTER THIS TOO! <sighs> and then eventually the boss fight. And then well, level two. Well, the point is, I would have to get through that room, get through the room after this without getting the save. <laughs> yeah. That's the one thing I don't like about games that don't autosave, is stupid, stingy save points. It's not as bad if the game isn't, you know, NINJA GODDAMN! Ding! Alright, alright, just one guy left. So who's gonna watch the Thuper Bowl tonight? Thuper Bowl? Yeah. I don't know, man. Who thinks gonna win the Patriots or the... Who else is playing? I don't even know who's playing. Patriots and Giants. The only reason I remember that is like it's like one of the most generic sounding Super Bowls ever. Just, you know, those two Northeast teams. Like we give a shit here in New Orleans. Yeah, really. Especially if you were to invite like somebody who wasn't from America to come watch the game. Who's playing? Uh, the Patriots and the Giants. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That sounds, that sounds very American. It does. It really does. That's right. He's like falling over to his death and I'm like, KICK! <laughs> Alright, I don't remember if there was an item over here or not that I can pick up. There was not. I remember this being well established now. What's this? We're getting into the next room? Uh, Yeah, we have time. We're gonna montage it, right? <laughs> I wanna get to the save point! Deep breath. <sighs> Quick, start talking about asses. Asses, asses. Metal Gear Solid. That hilarious shot when you're in the prison and the guy gets the heart attack. <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, that was totally unnecessary. Just gratuitous. Oh yeah, naked guard. There's his ass. I agree. I wasn't quite clear on whether that was supposed to be funny or... Just super realistic, or how and then that? right after that, I found a porn magazine. <laughs> really? Yeah, I, I, I'm surprised you didn't notice that part. No. It's a porn magazine. You put it on the ground. And it's supposed to distract guards. <laughs> like I'm not kidding. <laughs> I was like, "Are you serious?" That is awesome. Only in a Metal Gear Solid game. <laughs> oh God. What the hell? I didn't hit anyone with that. Fettius, Fettius, Fettius. No, no, no. Ha! Off with your head. Alright, there's only one other room I. Oh, what? Shit! <laughs> no, no, I'm not dealing with this right now. I'm not dealing with that. I'd forgotten all about that. I didn't know he was there. <laughs> Alright, one more room to go through, and a bunch of enemies spawn in this room, and I just have to make sure I don't fall down the trap door, <laughs> and there's a save point on the other side. Which I seem to remember you did the first time. I did. <laughs> Alright, here goes. Yes! <laughs> Skill! Um, 
let's go ahead and save over these other Master Ninja files, since we don't need them. And I'm going to go ahead and save over that one, too, just in case. Alright, no picking up where we were when we left off the first time. <laughs> Alright. So, that's it for this video, guys. In the next episode, I'll be going backwards a little bit, and then hopefully a little bit forwards. Probably not, though. <laughs> Fingers crossed. See you then.